This is the last day to pick up your Valentine's Day order for the notebook covers that I'm offering here. This one is the Bordeaux Minerva, made from that like wine color. One of the most beautiful leathers that I stock. This natural and black, I'm offering five of each color as a really small batch to get out for the holiday. Uh, today's the last day to order that to get that in time. I'm still working on the backlog, so I appreciate everybody who pre-ordered products. Uh, but I wanted to show off this leather because it doesn't get enough love for notebook covers. I think I've only ever posted one other video of me making this color notebook cover. Um, and it wasn't even a full walkthrough, but here you go. This is a full walkthrough of how I make my notebook covers by hand. Uh, I do have this clicker press, which is one of my newest tools added to the collection in the shop. Uh, and I got these clicker dies made of my exact pattern that I designed myself in Illustrator. Uh, and it's basically just a blade built into the wood piece that you stamp down on the leather and it cuts it out perfectly. So cuts down a lot of time and gets me uh, uh, quicker in production, more efficient. I can get things out a lot faster to you guys. Uh, now here I am burnishing the pen loops. If you're new around here, my notebook covers are designed so that the pen loops actually lock the notebook cover shut when the pen is through it. So there's a loop on the front piece and the back piece of the front cover and back cover so that when they come together, the pen goes through it, it locks them shut. Gives you a little bit of security, a little bit of privacy there. Uh, and it always includes a notebook and pen. The notebook that I include is a five by eight and a quarter. It's not quite an A5. The dimensions are a little bit reversed from the A5. I've had people say A5s have fit this cover. I haven't personally tested it myself. It might be a little tight, but I do include a notebook, the five by eight and a quarter, and I do include a pen. It's a fine tip pen. The pen does sort of vary depending on what I have in stock. These notebooks actually came with pens when I ordered them, so I decided to throw them in. These are, uh, like I said, a fine tip pen. They're, they're really smooth to use. Uh, but it fits all pretty standard pens. It can even, it's a little bit bigger than standard pens, so if you have a fountain pen, it may fit as well. Get a lot of requests for that too. Here I am just marking my stitching lines. I got the notebook pretty much assembled. This customer that ordered this notebook cover decided to go with more of a monotone look. They went with a burgundy stitching. Uh, I don't have a Bordeaux stitching, but the closest thing to it would be a burgundy and it blends it almost perfectly. Like from this shot, you can't even really tell the stitching is there. Uh, up close, you can see the detail of that. It's just a little bit lighter than the Bordeaux and it, it just looks really great. So once the Bordeaux leather actually patinas, the stitching color will pop a lot more because the, the leather will actually darken. It'll get richer, a little bit shinier when it patinas and it shows its use. Uh, and that stitching color will kind of stay that lighter burgundy. So it should show through over time. Here I am just beveling the edges, making sure they're not sharp uh, at a 90 degree angle. They're more rounded and beveled. And then I'm gonna clean it up with tokenol and canvas cloth, which is my burnishing process, uh, my preferred method at least, which is gonna harden those edges, lay the fibers down flat, get them nice and shiny and finished professionally. Here I am stuffing that book. It goes right into the sleeve. The front cover of the notebook does not go into the front cover of the notebook cover. They are two different pieces. It's meant to be an open flap. And here you have it. It's locked shut with that pen. It looks awesome. Uh, and here you go. So if you're interested in getting these by Valentine's Day, you can get five of these Bordeaux, five uh, natural and five black. I'll tag all these products uh, so that you can check them out. And yeah, there you go. This also includes free personalization. I do free engravings all the time because there's no sweat off my back. So let me know what you think.